Hello, primary children. Are you ready to sing? Got a question for you. Um, could you take a picture of something that hasn't happened yet? So if you had a camera, can you take a picture of something in the future? No, of course you couldn't do that, could you? That'd be impossible. But artists oftentimes will draw pictures of things that happen in the future. I have a picture to show you. Can you guess what this picture is about? It's an artist's picture of what he thinks it will be like when Jesus comes again. And we know that Jesus Christ will come again. In Come Follow Me this week, in section 45, it tells us of some of the things that are going to happen before he comes again. And some of those things might be a little scary. But if we think about the actual event of the Savior coming again, we can be quite excited. In Doctrine and Covenants, section 45, verses 44 and 45, it tells us a little bit about what the Savior, about how it will be like when the Savior comes in. So let me just read that. In 44, it says, And then they shall look for me, and behold, I will come, and they shall see me in the clouds of heaven, clothed with power and great glory, with all the holy angels. And then, and then verse 45, it even talks about, and an angel shall sound his trump. And so this artist, if you look real close, he did a pretty good job. Those angels even have trumpets. Okay, He did a pretty good job of drawing what it might look like when the Savior comes again. Um, so what do you think it might look like? What do you, how do you think it might be when the Savior comes again? This week's song starts out with, I wonder when he comes again. And then it goes into saying, well, I think it might be like this, or it might be like this, and I wonder if it will be like this. Maybe it will be like this. Okay. And so um, as I sing this song, listen to all the different things that the song mentions and see if you had been thinking about some of these things too. I wonder when he comes again, will herald angels sing? Will earth be white with drifted snow, or will the world know spring? I wonder if one star will shine far brighter than the daylight stay the whole night through? Will songbirds leave their nest? Did you think about any of those things that were mentioned in the song? Let's sing it through a few lines at a time and practice singing that. Okay, remember this is, I wonder when he comes again. Okay, I wonder when he comes again will herald angels sing so a herald angel is one who gives good news so have we ever had in angels come and give good news before when christ was born as a baby the angels came and they sang and they gave the news to the shepherds that he had been born so maybe when he comes again, maybe there'll be angels there. And that one scripture tells us, tells us that there will be. Okay, from the start. I wonder when he comes again, will herald angels sing? Will earth be white with drifted snow? Or will the world know spring? We don't know if it'll be winter time when we have white snow on the ground or if it'll be springtime when we have flowers growing. And it really doesn't matter when he comes. What's more important is that we are ready for him to come, that we try to live each day a little bit more like him. Okay, sing, sing with me again. Let's go from the top. 
I wonder when he comes again, will herald angels sing? Will earth be white with drifted snow, or will the world know spring? I wonder if one star will shine far brighter than the rest. Will daylight stay the whole night through? Will songbirds leave their nest? When was another time that we had a bright star shine far brighter than the rest and daylight stay the whole night through when the savior was born as a baby once again remember we had the star in the sky that the wise men followed the nephites in the american continent had daylight when it became nighttime it was still bright so maybe if it happened when he was born and came before maybe maybe it'll be that way again okay the second half of the song, it says, I'm sure things will happen. So the first part is kind of, I wonder. And the second part, the, the um, composer of the song says, I'm sure something will happen. So from the very top, let's go all the way through and I'll sing the end for you. I wonder when he comes again. Will herald angels sing? Will earth be white with drifted snow? Or will the world know spring? I wonder if one star will shine far brighter than the rest. Will daylight stay the whole night through? Will songbirds leave their nest? I'm sure he'll call his little ones to gather round his knee. Because he said in days gone by, suffer them to come to me. So what are we sure about? We're sure that he's going to call, all, gather the little ones around his knee. So when we say that, maybe you do some arm motions. I'm sure he'll call his little ones to gather around his knee. Because he said in days gone by, suffer them to come to me. And suffer means allow them to come to me. Let them come to me. Allow them, suffer them to come to me. Okay, what I'd like to do now is I am going to play the music and I'm gonna sing one line and then I'm not gonna sing a line. And we're gonna go through it two times. And so I want you to sing all the time, but I'm not gonna sing all the time. Okay, let's see how it goes.
love that song. I look forward to the day when the Savior will come again. Um, in the email, which I sent the link to this song to, um, there was an attachment for a little coloring page. And so the first coloring page, the first page of it, has the first verse, and there's eight pictures here that you can color, and it has a song. And so I hope you'll have fun coloring it and singing along. And then the second page is the second verse, which we're not going to do today, but the second verse is beautiful. And so I encourage you to color the second pictures that go with the second verse and practice singing the second verse of the song too. If you have any trouble printing it off or anything, just let me know and I can print some off and get it to you at church or mail it to you in the mail or something. Um, hope you have a wonderful week and happy singing. Bye.